hello welcome to my channel and today um, here I am again with another review of a NYX proof it product this is called the NYX waterproof eyeshadow primer and according to the box it says I'm waterproof your eyebrows apply to lids as any eyeshadow primer and voila any eye makeup placed on top of it is now waterproof keep your makeup from melting off if you're at the beach lounging by the pool or during humid weather and then here they have a little picture as to how to you know how to use it and they have these little um, instructions so let me read to you the instructions it says number one apply to eyelid set and let dry for a bit and then apply shadow so um, it comes it comes in a tube like this and it has a doe foot applicator and the actual primer itself is a flesh color okay and so um, I have been using this for the past two weeks and I have had mixed results um, first time that I used it is um, I put it on all over and then I put on my uh, I did wait a few minutes you know a few yeah maybe a minute or so to until it was kind of sticky and then I put on my eye makeup and then I did other things and then I even took a nap and then when I woke up I was really happy because everything was still there the colors are very still very vivid my eyeliner didn't smudge everything was perfect so I was so excited and so the next day I used it again uh, but this time I still had some um, red other eye primer so I just put the regular eye, my other eye primer on my upper lids and in my lower lash area I used this and um, I got not so good results um, the I have teary eyes and so here in my core in my eye corner here is when the t where the tears usually come out and that area has been washed away by the tears even if I use this and it's supposed to be waterproof and so the next day I said oh maybe um, I was doing something wrong or whatever so I did it again I put it on again I used some other eye primer on my upper lids and used this primer for my lower lids and then I got so busy I was doing other things and I forgot that I still haven't you know I hadn't applied my eye makeup on my lower lashes yet for a, for about half an hour so when I came back I said oh I have to put it on now so I put it on and um, within an hour and a half everything got washed away and when I say I have teary eyes it's not like I'm copiously you know continuously crying and crying it's just like little um, tears teardrops come out of the corner of my eye and go like that so it's always these two outer corners that get affected and so I said oh maybe I waited too long and so the next day I tried it again and so the next day I put it on and I said I didn't wait for it to get sticky or to dry a little bit and I put on eye makeup and of course that didn't work and everything you know was gone and so I said, what about if I just use this eye primer all over my lid, upper and lower, maybe the use of that other primer, even if it didn't touch this bottom area, maybe it affected it in some way or whatever. And um, what I can say is it did improve the wear, okay? However, it still washed off the outer corner let me um, go into a close-up so you can see okay do you see this here is all gone and see the smudges here see here but see you can still see some eyeliner right there right so that the part that was not affected by the tears still looks okay um, and then here on the other side see it still looks smudgy but most of it here that was not touched by the tears is still there but you can still see some smudges maybe when the tears flowed you know it kind of touched some of it and smeared some of it so I guess that's not the fault of the 
NYX um, eyeshadow primer. Um, as far as my upper eyelids, you know, here in my upper lashes here is concerned, um, I think it helped protect the color um, that I applied here in my upper, in the here in this upper area. And, but at the end of eight hours, I would say that the intensity of the color diminished by about 30%, 30%. So it didn't stay at 100%. This is much lighter uh, than it was when I, you know, when I, it was freshly applied compared to when it was freshly applied. Now, after maybe eight or nine hours, it has been diminished by 30%. Anyway, um... One more thing that I wanted to say is that in the upper eyelids, um, it wasn't, the reason why it was only diminished by maybe 30% uh, is because of course my tears don't go up, right? The tears either go this way or they go down like this. Uh, and so of course the tears don't touch my upper eyelids. And so in that respect, you know, um, the primer did work. And so I think that this primer worked somewhat. Um, and if you don't have teary eyes, it might, it might work. But for teary eyed person, you know, persons like me, um, it's still not a hundred percent. So um, out of maybe 10, I would rate this maybe a 7 or a 6. Um, and I wish NYX or some other um, cosmetics company could come up with a tear-proof eyeshadow primer. That would be really, really great. And so, um, thank you for um, listening to my um, story. And I hope you found this review very useful. And um, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you soon. Bye.